So, hi everybody. Uh, today we are going to show how to do rectangle reflection, that is how to do these kind of drawings. Starting from this image, we want to add this to rectangular selection. And you observe one selection as corners and the other one in the other one corner are smoothed. So let's uh, let's start. We use the gimp as usual. Then we open the image we want to modify. I know that the image name is this one. Good. I adapt the size to hundred. And then what we do? Well, I recommend you make um, a new layer and call it uh, rectangles. Rectangles. Okay, you should the new layer is selected and now we make our rectangular selection which is quite easy. Or you could you can use this icon or tools selection tool rectangular select. And so let's make a rectangle. Okay. Observe this for this very interesting feature. If you have the mice mouse pointer inside and you push the arrow keys you see the rectangle moves okay it translates instead if say you want to change the position of a line for example this side again you move the arrow keys left and right and you see that the line is moved in this direction again move here you see left right top bottom and top okay so you know how to adjust finally the rectangle well now that we have the rectangle we say uh, we we are fine with hard corners so we can do uh, just select the color for example uh, red and say stroke selection Stroke selection, in this case, you can start easy with this stroke line and do stroke for pixel size, stroke, and that's it. Let's do uh, another selection here with a rounded corner. So, tool selection tool, rectangle select here. Okay, then you see here rounded corners, so you see, watch out at this shape and, and move this, you see what happens? Okay, so let's say that this rounded corner is enough, then we can do, mm, let's change color, for example, to a green and let's stroke the selection uh, we can use again solid line stroke line or um, uh, you can use the paint tool i for rounded corner prefer the paint tool and I use the paint brush only remember that you need to check the paint brush so you need to go to check the paint brush size here okay paint brush size for pixels so you see it here the dimension let's see bigger 11 so it's going to be a quite a thick stroke let's do it you see here we have it so now consider um, if you want to get rid of all this selection you just don't see the rectangles layer and that's it Okay, rectangle layer. So now you are ready to save your image and proceed with your work. I hope you find it useful. Goodbye.